Alright, hello! Welcome back to Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate once again. On the last episode, this dude with the cool sword showed up, and I'm trying to talk to him. I'll just kind of have to do a loop. So, Hunter, you're looking for Captain the Argo Argosy? Argosy? It's Ar whatever it is. I so look no more, for I am he. Okay. Mayhap. Okay, that's a word that you shouldn't be using, Mr. Elf Ears. May have you wondering why a man known as Giant of Far Off East would sail his trade ship to Itty Bitty Village? Uh, well, yeah, fair, fair question. Ha, I'm glad you asked. Moga Village, fa Moga Village famous for rare items, commodities, fetch a big price overseas. Okay, so he's here to loot our goods. Fair enough. Nothing that comes free. You bring me these commodities, I offer you trade goods from around the globe in Kukan. Kukan means exchange. Okay, so just say exchange then if you already if you know the translation. You want an explanation of how trading works? Mm, no, that's fine. Very well, you figure out trading process without my help. Not that hard. Here, Hunter, we take practice trade right now. Take this. Pr pr okay, I'll take that present. Uh, he gave me a curved fr fang. I almost said frang. All right, so what is that? Okay, so he's I got things and he's got things and I Don't exactly know what I I, I, can, I would like some of these pickaxes, but I Can't really afford a whole lot. Yeah, like even oh, okay. That does work, but I don't need to right now I, th I would like I would like one of those pickaxes, but um what does this do? Fertile lands, so I can tell them to go to different places. I don't, un I don't quite know what the point of this is yet. Maybe I shouldn't have skipped, like, figuring it out. But I, at any rate, we don't really have a whole lot to work with, anyways, right now. So it's probably not that big of a deal. All right. Well, let's talk to the old man again. Welcome back, kid. I bet you're wondering where all the skyline's gone. Behold, the Argosy, our link to the outside world. Well, wow, that's not depressing at all. One dude on a boat is their only outside contact. The Argosy trade... It's a trade ship, you see. The commodities we find in the Moga Woods fetch a pretty zenny abroad. Oh, hey, I actually got it right. It is zenny. Thank you, Mega Man Legends. As for the Argosy captain, he's a wealthy merchant from the Far East. I've known him longer than I care to admit, and I hope I didn't insult his ears by because he's from the East. Oh boy! Oh well, that's fine. We're reckless use together. Once upon a time, I saved his life. I saved his life many times, and he mine. I'm sure he'd be willing to barter with you if you have any commodities. The captain's your man. How come he's so much younger than you if you've been friends for a long time? Unless he just doesn't age. Cause like you're a super old man. In fact, you're the only old man in this village. There's no one else even remotely near your age here. Like everyone else is young, but you're not. Uh, at any rate, maybe everyone's just dying before old age because of the stupid Ligarius, Ligaya, Chris. Erp, oh, la, la, I'm sick, disease stomach. Uh, okay, so he's a French dude. Oh, he's claws, it's genius. It was not cut out for the ocean. My dream was to dream of the world's best recipes. Why don't we just make him like Pepe Le Pew or something at this rate? Not to regurgitate them, but blah blah blah, no more sea voyages, the chef McCallum belongs in the kitchen, that holds still. Unfortunately, your chef, your chief, sorry, your chief was kind enough to allow me to stay here. In return, I have agreed to cook. Great, okay, so he's gonna just stay here and cook. Man, the boats really must have not been his thing. If he took, like, he was probably supposed to go back and, like, see his cat family and everything, and he's like, no, fuck it, I'm just staying on this island. I don't want back on the boat. It was terrible. Welcome, dear hunter. Do you mean like I am a deer friend or I hunt deer? I I guess it was deer as in a friend, but still, I could be hunting deer or whatever the equivalent is. Business has gotten much better with the Argosy coming to the village for now, and whenever she's in port selected items will be half off. What a deal! Ah, capitalism at its finest, even on the tiny wood island, on on like a raft, basically. I've gotten loads of new items too. What a relief! Before the Argosy returned, I would have ran out of stock. Or if he hadn't returned, she would have ran out of stock. Say, if you're headed to warmer climates, I suggest taking some cool drinks. Are they, like, cool as in they wear aviators, or are they just, like, chilly? Spending too much time swearing, sweltering in areas that saps your health. Cool drink will clear your head and help you beat the heat, so stop when you're losing health. The cool drink, blah, 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 bl
I can buy some like Oh no, I can't buy pickaxes. How come I how come I can't buy more pickaxes for like 80 points? Oh, because I have too many in my How come I can't just send them to the Oh buy send a box. Okay. Let's buy some pickaxes. We'll send Ah, uh, I don't want to send too many. I'll send 20 there. That'll be enough, right? There we go. Now we got some backup pickaxes. That's a good idea. There's some of those drinks, but I don't think we need them right now. There's some herbs. Which we could use. Um those are all like ammo. And I think these are for I think these are for like guns, like the ones with ammo, and then these like are for the bow, and then there's Book of Combos. Sweet. I've always wanted to learn everything from the Mortal Kombat training menu. Introductory text, first time comers, proves your combination success rate. Actually, I will buy that. Hold on. I'll send... Oh, wait, yeah, I want to send that to the box. There we go. Let's send that to the box. And send this to the box. And now we're broke. But now we're going to have a lot easier of a time combining things and not ending up with random poop. Because that was happening to me between episodes. I don't know how you fail combining something, but apparently you can, so... Yeah, no. Probably good not to do that. Not waste things. Hey, old hunter! I hear you got a request to bag one of the big boys. Uh, that's inappropriate. Guess it's high time I taught you about the target cam. Bust that sucker out when you're after large monsters. When you're same area as large monster, the tarp top right icon changes into a monster icon, eh? When you see that, pressing ZR will switch to target mode. When you tap the L button lightly, the camera will pan to face the large monster. Handy, huh? I did not... I... Don't actually know what ZR is on my GameCube controller, so we'll have to figure that out in the heat of battle. It's probably the Z button, but I'm not certain. All right, what do you want? Hello, Hunter. We make good with the what? Nico means cat, my fiercest crewman. Oh, your chef cat, who you are apparently such a shitty captain, he just does not want to deal with you. He doesn't want any of your boat or its BS, and he's gonna stay here. So. Um, he charred. If you want, if you wish to visit Tanzia, speak to feline that smell like adventure. He takes you to Tanzia, helping other. Okay, thank you. Okay, so I take the boat and it takes me to a different place. Fair enough. I can handle that. I don't have any rare commodities. I have these. But I don't really. I mean, aside from those pickaxes, I don't really need anything. And if I could just keep buying the iron ones, it's kind of okay. Hey, Hunter, did you see the Argosy is here? We could help. How well? How could you not see? It's freaking enormous. <laughs> okay, you know what? Yeah, I like. I like this chick. This is the one chick in the village that like we better not fuck anything up with because she's actually got a personality. Argosy is a trade ship. It's been a part of a mogul village for the life as far back as I can remember, but I'll leave the storytelling to the chief. I've got more important stuff to tell you about. For example, the new hunting ground. Ooh. See, top class hunters don't just poke around home. They hunt far and wide. For Pokemon? You earned your stripes with that Ludroth quest, and now you're clear to hunt in a brand spanking new location. It's called the Sandy Plains. Hmm. Wondering what sort of place this is? Me too. I don't think it has sand. Probably not, if it's called Sandy Plains. It's a dry region known for its high temperatures and hordes of monsters. Well, good luck with that. Yeah, thanks. Real thanks. You can just stay here and hide behind your book, I guess. Now, let's talk harvest tours. Not too long after the quest starts, a paw pass ticket will be added to your supplies. Deliver that whenever you want to head back. Until then, collect all the items you got. Or, all the items you can. Got it? Have fun. Also, on the home front, there's a quest on the hunt. To hunt a great jaggy, the guild will definitely be watching for that one. And speaking of watching, don't you wish there was an easy way to keep an eye on a large monster while on the hunt? Night is dark, ham. Yeah, the other guy told me. Uh, oh, wait. This, you just told me different. You said it's L, and the other person said ZL. Oh, it's the same thing. It might be like the bumpers on the Wii U pad, but I'm. I do not have it. Okay, so that's the new one. That's the new area. But we've got stuff to do in this old area first. And they said there was something about a great jaggy. So that seems like it's a bit more pressing at the moment. Hunter, talk to the cook. Okay, thank you. Um, this is just telling me that I can eat at this guy's restaurant. Take this old voucher, hand it over, and it'll treat you to a feast for fit for a king. You don't even have to worry about ingredients. Well, 
normally you don't when you go to see a chef at his restaurant. You don't have to bring all the ingredients like, make me this meal. Generally, that's what I'm paying for, is for them to have the ingredients and also prepare them in a way that is much more delectable than the way I could. Alright, you got something to ask for. You're already making use of the farm, didn't it? Talk to the head farmer and he wants to uh, bug box. Okay, it's going to take resources and I have to give them to you. Alright, I can handle that. Unless it's like 6,000. 150 and one monster fluid. Um, How do I get monster fluid again? I don't even know how to get monster fluid. Well, that's going to be a problem. I'm going to have to look that up because I don't know. I don't know how to get that. Figure you couldn't just drain some of its blood unless I don't know what fluid they want to make that box, but I don't really probably want to find out if it's that hard to get. Alright, so where is this great jaggy quest? Maybe it's... Okay, hold on, let's see this. Big hunt. No, bug hunt. No, that's not what I want. Hunt a great jaggy! Oh, okay, so there it is. Well, I need... What do I need? I need some of those cool drinks. Service with smile, da ba bum ba bum buy. I will buy some of your cool drinks, ma'am. Alright, there we go. I wonder if I can craft those for cheaper. I probably can. We'll have to see. Alright, so... Let us go hunt this guy. If I can. Pain in the plains. Hunt a great jaggy. Alright. Now, they said something about a meal as well. I don't exactly know where I'm supposed to get it at. Um, I guess maybe I just can't get it yet? I probably have to like leave the area and then it will load him in. That's all right, we don't need a meal. Although, hold on, do I have any like cooked meat to bring? I may not actually just wanna like go in hot without some stuff if this is an actual boss fight. I may in fact need some, some sort of something. Maybe, you know what, can we like, can we just back out of this for now? I'm just not quite prepared. I wasn't, all right, there we go, thank you. I hope that didn't cost me money. All right, for now, we're gonna, let's let's just go and do some smaller things. Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. I will, I will prep myself for that, just to be safe, because I don't know how hard it's gonna be. So, I'm not entirely sure, like, how difficult, basically, and if I really need to do any of that. We will find out. Can I take any of this, or... Do I need to take any of this, is what I meant to say. Alright, so I am collecting, I think it said three horns. I should probably get some of this meat while I'm here, too. I sorry to disappoint anyone who thought I was going to go fight something bigger. Um, I didn't expect it to come... Like, I figured, yeah, there's going to be stuff later on, but... I figured it would be once I was a little more established, and I really haven't... To be fair, I've kind of been neglecting my, uh, my duties. I haven't been prepping for a big fight. So that's on me. Um, let's grab some of these mushrooms really quick before I go and find these guys with their horns. I don't know where they are. I think it might be the guys that are up in area like one, so like right across from me, up that hill. So we're, I'll take a look up there. Um, and if not... I don't know. I guess I'll probably just follow that side of the map. Because it's not going to be... They're not going to be in the water, I don't think. So... For what it's worth, it's probably smartest just to sweep this side of the map. And there's no one here! Oh, good. I can at least mine this. There's some bugs here, too. I suppose I can kill them. Ha! What? Aha! Oh, I only got your friend. Alright, now you're dead, too. At least you're with your friends. All right, let's mine this really quick. Iron ore. Okay, so... I don't exactly know what the difference in pickaxes is. It seems like they break quicker. Um, I'm, I'm not sure if they like are more efficient as well. Like, they give you better resources. I would imagine they probably do. Otherwise, there wouldn't be a whole lot of incentive to use the better ones. All right, you give me your horn. Please. Cause that's what I think I was supposed to do. Warm pelt. That was not a horn. That was a pelt. Alright, what about you? Can I just kill you? You don't really look like you have horns, but... Okay, what about you? What? 
Oh, he jumped it. Or he got away from me. There we go. Oh, I didn't get him. There we go. That's why I want to use the sword, at least at the beginning, because killing, like, tiny little things... Nah, no, I'm just getting pelts from these guys. This isn't going to help me at all. That's not going to help me achieve what I'm trying to do in the slightest. So let's go in here and maybe... Like, look, the one guy looked like he had a horn. What about... Okay. I need to kind of sneaky snake my way. Like, these guys look like they got horns, especially this dude. Don't you run. Don't run from me! Ha. Okay. Oh, good. Nope. Overhand swing. There we go. Got him. I got three hits in there somehow, and I don't know what. I don't know how the third hit came about. Oh wait, come on. This guy's got a horn. How am I supposed to? There we go. Okay, that guy gave me a horn, so I just got unlucky. It was what happened there. So wait, can they all give me horns, or is it only the big guys? Like I don't. I don't want to just run around. And Cut these, like, every tiny one I see. Because by that that logic, I could, it's just pure luck. I, white liver, ew. I cut out that thing's liver, that's disgusting. And it got back up and ran away. What in the world? You're not going to make it far without your liver, buddy. I mean, I guess you can try. Oh, no, he gave me a horn, too. Okay, so I just have to kill whatever I can. All right, well, hopefully, come here, I need to harvest your organs. No. Hup. Up, oh, missed. Hup. There we go. Do it again. Stab him. There we go. Come on, give me your horn. I don't know how these things give me their horn. Or how they can give me a horn when they really don't have any. I might as well mine this one here, too. Gotta kind of just be as efficient as possible while doing this. I don't even know where to look now. Oh, wait, there's a guy over there. I see you. He probably sees me. Oh, there's his friend. He brought a friend. All right, you guys just stay stacked up like that so I can get a sick double kill. Ho! Oh, stay there! Stay there! Ha! 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 There we go. All right. Amazing. That was perfect. Can I get an extra one just for funsies? Are you going to give me... going to be nice? Oh, hey! Another one! Hello! Did you come to see your friends off to the, uh, to the other side? Come to say a nice few words in whatever language you speak, dear? Your weird deer language. Yeah, now, now they're just pooping horns everywhere. Now they're all... Now, I think it's because I don't need it. They're probably being a lot more generous with it. All right, well... I mean, if... When in Rome at this point... Okay, well, I got some raw meat from his butt. That's kind of gross, but... That's fine. I mean, really? Okay, you know what? They're just going to keep spawning. Let's just get out. Let's just mine this and get out of here. Because they're just going to keep coming back, I think. At this point, I feel like I could possibly get overrun with how many are just popping out. I know they're probably actually... I don't even think those things can attack me, but... If they really felt like it, they could probably just, like, get a whole group of them and trample me. If they really felt like it. Okay, what's the quickest way out of here? Probably this way, right? I mean, none of this is really quick, but... There's that guy again. Hello, friend. Go over here. Man, I wish there was a way to sprint longer. I mean, it's not like it's an RPG and I can just, like, put points into sprinting. Wait, how do... What in the world? How do I get over here? Where's the path? It says there's a path right here. Um... Okay. What? How is there a path? There's no path. Th this is a lie. The this is, there's no path. I see no path. Unless I can, like, jump off the waterfall or something. What in the world? What is this? Why is there, like, a path off to Narnia all over here? What? Can I, like, jump off of this or something? What in the world? Oh, I know, I'm just an idiot. I thought I could jump that. Okay, so it was just the map being, like, kind of weird. Or me being stupid. All right, fair enough. That's fine. That's all right. If you if you sat through like twenty some minutes of that, that's what that's what you were gifted. You were gifted that stupidity. I probably should have killed those guys for their meat while I was here. I think it's been like twenty minutes. I'm not exactly sure how long it's been. Probably about time to wrap it up. But we'll wait till we get back to the village and see if 
Cause I don't wanna I don't wanna leave you guys and get a cutscene for all that great stuff I just did. You never know. You never know if they're gonna put those horns on. Like they're like tied around their waist and pretend it's like a really big penis or something. Or on their foreheads. And pretend it's a really big penis and not a horn. I maybe I, it's not my fault they're obsessed with penises, okay? It's not my fault that every time you bring something phallic-shaped into their village, that they just immediately jump to that conclusion. Calbi horn, some raw meat, some mushrooms. Okay, cool. Quest rewards. We got 800 zenny, and now we're heading back. Yeah, I think that was just like a nice little fetch quest. All right. Okay. Yeah, no, I think that's about it. I think that, yep, that was just a little fetch quest. All right, so we'll see you on the next episode of Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate. Be sure to leave a like and stuff, and don't worry about not fighting the Jaggy. I promise I'll get stuff ready so we can. Bye!